Hello there everyone, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to take apart so that you can replace the LCD and glass screen assembly on your Huawei Mate 10 Pro. Hello everyone, welcome to Cellular Pros. In this channel we do tech reviews and tutorials, so if you're new to the channel I welcome you to subscribe. Alright, let's go right to the video now. So let's go ahead and get right into it. First thing we're going to want to do is we're going to need to give it some heat here in this back glass cover. So first off, let's power the phone off so that we can work on it while it's powered off. Let's also remove the SIM card and SIM card tray if you haven't done so already. Put that to the side. And with a hairdryer or heat gun, we can give it heat around the edges here of the back. Continue to move it around so that you don't burn the back or you can place it on a hot plate, which is what I like to use. And I set the hot plate to about 110 degrees Celsius and leave it on there for about two or three minutes. So we're gonna be using a suction cup, a small Phillips head screwdriver, a prying tool, a couple different prying tools. We can use a plastic prying tool. Uh, you can also use a business card. You can fold it in half and use it as a prying tool as well. So once it's hot enough, oh, I'm going to go ahead and hold the phone with this so I don't burn my hands. I don't have any gloves at the moment. And we're going to place the suction cup here towards the bottom. And we're going to start giving it some upwards suction pressure here until you see a slight opening in the glass. Once you see a slight opening, we're going to stick the prying tool in there very carefully and gently. Once you have the prying tool in the phone, we're going to go ahead and move it side to side to remove the adhesive holding down the back glass to the frame of the phone. Once you have most of it removed, you can remove the suction cup and place another prying tool in for extra help. We're going to use one prying tool to go down one side of the phone like this and the other one to the other side. Let's continue to go down on all sides until most of the back is completely lifted up. Once you get towards the top of the phone here, try and remove the rest of the adhesive. You can wiggle the back around for extra help on removing any adhesive that is still on there. But be careful since there is going to be the cable connecting the fingerprint scanner connected to the motherboard, as you can see here. So next up with the small Phillips head screwdriver, we're going to remove a small Phillips head screw, which is holding down this bracket. Once you have that out of the way, we can go ahead and remove the bracket and disconnect the cable holding down the fingerprint scanner flex. There we go, so the back cover is now out of the way. So we're gonna need the small Phillips head screwdriver to remove the Phillips head screws holding down the back frame. Once all of these screws are out of the way, we can go ahead and lift up on this back bracket. It comes right out. Next, let's go ahead and disconnect the flex cables up here. Um, and disconnect the battery flex cable to stop any electricity from flowing through the phone. And this last cable is for the bottom charging port section. So now we're going to go ahead and remove the bottom screws with the small Phillips head screwdriver that hold down the bottom charging port. Let's remove the bracket and now let's disconnect the cable. We have another small flex cable right down here. Let's go ahead and disconnect these antennas. Move them out of the way. And now we can go ahead and pull up on the charger port section and it comes out completely. Next up, we're going to need to give it some heat on the front of the screen here so that we can remove the battery. So once again, give it heat with a hairdryer heat gun or place it on the hot plate. Once it's hot enough with a prying tool, we're going to give it some pressure upwards to lift up on the battery. I suggest using plastic prying tools so that you don't short out the battery. 
there we go the battery is now removed so now this is the flex cable here for the LCD screen assembly if you want to place the screen all you would have to do here is give it some heat here on the front of the screen and lift it up around the edges with a prying tool pry up around all sides and lift up on this old um, LCD screen assembly once you're ready go ahead and place the new LCD in and the cable into the slot and place all of the parts back in in reverse order And that is how you take apart to replace the LCD and glass screen assembly on your Huawei Mate 10 Pro. All right, everyone, so that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope it helped you out. If it did, please give it a like. It really helps the channel out a lot. So that's it for now. I'll see you around in the next video. And as always, peace. Ciao.